Ian Hamilton was named one of Rolling Stone's five comics to watch. Yeah, you can find out why when Ryan takes you to the stage. It's a Liberty Funny Bone this weekend. But right now, Ryan is here with us. And thanks so much for coming in. Oh, Hi, thanks Ryan. for having me. Hi. Oh, you're right. Uh, now, now, <laughs> One of uh, Rolling Stone's five comics to watch. How did that happen? Uh, I don't. I don't know. I've been a comic to watch for a while now. <laughs> <Yeah>. uh, <laughs> hopefully someday I'm just a comic uh, that yeah. you know. But uh, um, yeah, they, they just saw me at shows around. And That's nice. Yeah, well, yeah. you were telling us that you're from Idaho. Yes. And, <laughs> and, but you perform in New York City and really yeah. all over the world. You've been to Sydney, Australia. Yeah. What was it like to move from Idaho and the kind of farming community where you grew up to New York City? Well, it was a very uh, smooth transition. Really? Uh, <laughs> Are you no, sure? <laughs> New Yorkers, uh, I, nobody's ever met anyone from Idaho. Right. I get that often. It's like nobody, I, I, where are you from, Idaho? And the feeling that comes back is kind of like, why? You know, it's like, I can't, I've never met anyone from there. Yeah. I don't understand where you're from. So it was uh, a bit of a transition, but I, I love New York. Um, I love it there, but it took me a while to figure it out. You I'm know sure. what I mean? Yeah, it took me a while. <laughs> yeah. Uh, your stand up, is it observational kind of stuff, like what you see going on in commentary? Yeah, on yeah, just a lot of observational stuff, what's going on in my life. Um, I spend a lot of time alone, unfortunately. I'm sorry. Uh -huh. It's okay. I get to talk to you. Do you <laughs> You know, I talk to you at least. Yeah. Uh, I don't talk to anybody anymore. This is all I do. I just do this and then I go home and try and think of things to tell strangers tomorrow. Or you know, it's not a great way to live <laughs> life. I just, I wake up, sometimes my phone will ring at, I don't know, 4 p.m. and I have to warm my voice up. I don't know if you've ever had you've that. Because yeah, yeah, spoken all day? Do you have that moment of reality where it's just like, oh, that's life right there. I need to talk to somebody. <laughs> la, 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 la. <laughs> Hello. That's my life. Well, uh, I was reading that you're known for being a clean comedian. Yeah. Yeah. Now, is that a conscious choice that you make? I think it's just kind of the way I am anyway. I never made a choice that said I'm going to be okay. a clean comedian. Well, you're from Idaho. I would expect you right. would be clean. Yeah. Why, why do I think that? <laughs> I don't know. I look like where I'm from, though, too. You kind of do. Write, yeah, I look like a person you go, that guy could sell ice cream in the 50s, I think. <laughs> yes! So, uh, I kind of think that's where it comes from. I don't know. I don't know if I could do anything other than something that uh, someone from the 50s who's selling ice cream could do. You just can't see other things coming out of my mouth. Okay, you come from a small farming community. Yeah. When did you find out that you were funny? <laughs> <laughs> you know, I, um, I don't know. I'm still working on it, I yeah. think. But uh, I don't know. I was, I was actually pretty shy in growing up, and, which is not that uncommon for comedians, mm -hmm. I think. Um, but I felt like I was an observational person. And I always kind of connected with comedians when I saw them on television. It was something that I just always enjoyed watching and was very interested in. I never thought about it as a career, but um, you know, maybe someday I'll be able to pull it off as a career. Well, apparently you are, because <laughs> you you've received right. lots yeah, and lots you. of awards, and you can go <laughs> see you. Ryan at the Liberty Funny Show, uh, Funny Bone, two shows tonight, two tomorrow, one on Sunday, and we've got the link for tickets and all that good stuff at local12.com. Yeah. All right, uh, Ron, thanks, thanks for Ryan. Thank you, I appreciate it. Thank yeah. you, I will. I